financial KPIs are metrics organizations use to track, measure and analyze the financial health of the company. These financial KPIs fall under a variety of categories including profitability, liquidity, solvency, efficiency and valuation. Burn rate indicates how quickly your startup is spending money. You can calculate your cash runway and determine whether to cut costs or invest more in your business such as in hiring or marketing and development. Monitor your burn rate regularly to watch for fluctuations that may indicate unexpected expenses. Always know if your burn rate is going up or down and include that fact in your analysis. Cash runway takes it a step further and indicates how long your money will last. You can determine whether to be more aggressive with sales, cut expenses or enact other measures to extend your runway. Always know your cash runway will change as your cash balance and burn rate shift. It also does not take into account upcoming revenue currently in the sales pipeline. The sales pipeline will give you an idea of upcoming deals and potential revenue growth that can extend your runway. Gross Profit Margin Gross Profit Margin looks at the difference between revenue and cost of goods sold or COGS. GPM should remain fairly steady over time. If not, it may mean either expenses or sales or both are fluctuating more than they should. There are some exceptions to this, such as seasonal business. Revenue churn rate Revenue churn rate is the percentage of revenue lost in a set period due to downgrades or cancellation. It shows the amount of income lost through churn, which can help you determine if the churn is coming from small or large accounts. SaaS companies typically measure this KPI as monthly recurring revenue or MRR churn because much of the SaaS customer churn is from cancelled subscription. Compare revenue churn rate with customer churn rate to see if you are mainly losing smaller or starter accounts or if your churn is coming from larger long-term accounts. The latter could indicate serious problems with your customer retention policies, whereas the former may indicate an issue with product fit for new customers. Revenue Growth Rate Revenue Growth Rate measures the month-over-month -month percentage increase in revenue. It is an indicator of how quickly your startup is growing. A high revenue growth rate can help you measure increasing demand for your product. Similar to revenue churn rate, SaaS companies typically measure this startup metric as MRR growth rate. Compare MOM and year-over-year -year revenue growth rate to see the short and long-term growth trajectory of your business. Past financial metrics are important inputs for future decision making. The metrics serve as your report card and enable you to review if your efforts have paid off and also determine what has to change to improve performance.